Hello, I'm Dr. Bob Neff for Equestrian Nation, and today I'm going to talk about injecting joints on a horse. This is Google, and we have done a lameness examination on him and determined that he needs to have some work done on some joints to make him feel better. Sometimes horses, when they are performance horses and ridden a lot, they get sore joints, and so we have to inject their joints to make them feel better. My assistant here, Emily, is preparing the joints sterilely, um, and after she is done preparing them, I will put on sterile gloves using sterile technique, and I will put needles into the hock joints and inject them with steroids, which help to decrease inflammation and make the joint a happier, um, healthier environment. So Emily is scrubbing the joints with a product called Betadine. It is a soap, a sterile surgical soap that we use to clean the area that we need to put the needles in so that it is as clean as possible. It's very important. Now the area that we're injecting, as many of you may know, is the hock. This is the hock region, and in the hock there are four joints. The two joints that we typically inject are the two lower, lower joints. Hello, buddy. So now you may not be able to see, but there is joint fluid that's, that has come up into the hub of this needle. And that is what we're looking for to make sure that we're in the right place. I attach my syringe and then slowly inject. Once we've been finished, finished injecting all of the joints, uh, the joints will get cold hosed for about 10 to 15 minutes, and the horse will be taken care of over the next several days with hand walking and then slowly brought back into work. And that's how we inject joints. <laughs>